Hello guys, yeah, welcome to this video. I'm Zach at Opportunities Niche and in this video, I'm going to be showing you the proper way to target audience, okay? To get a proper result. I'm also going to be showing you how to duplicate your ad, your campaign into four or five so that you test different audience for your campaign. See, whether you are an interior designer, you want more people to patronize your business, whether you are a cake baker, you are an affiliate marketer, what, or you are selling your own courses, or affiliate courses, whatever you are selling, being a digital office car product or services, they are the head of your ad. What makes your ad work is the proper targeting of the audience. So today I'm just going to be narrowing for one niche, which is interior design. If you're an interior designer, I will use it for an example to uh, actually run an ad by dividing the ad. You target different set of people in four ad set and see the one that is performing properly. At the end of the day, you should be able to know that this ad, you need to kill it, the one that's not working well, while the one that is performing, you need to optimize it, okay? So I'm going to show you how to set up this campaign, how to duplicate the ad, and how to know the one that is performing better. So if this is your first time on my channel, if I give you value, you know you are going to benefit from this video, just subscribe, just subscribe to my channel, so that my channel will grow, so that more people will get to watch this video, it will really help a lot, okay? Thank you very much let's get started all right guys you are welcome like i said we are going to create the ad campaign now we are going to create the campaign for interior designer let's say i'm an interior decorator and i want to get massive results for my ad so we set up the ad first then we now duplicate the asset and each of that asset will contain different audience that we target at the end of the day we'll be able to know the one that is performing better we kill the one that is performing poorly and the ones that will be giving us good results from the asset we optimize it we increase the budget and so on and so forth so now right now you log into your facebook account you can from your facebook account go to your account manager but me i prefer once you log in you open a new tab and once you open a new tab you type business.facebook.com and uh, you go directly and uh, this will take you to your ad manager so right now you can see we are in my business suit and this is the account you select the account as usual i know you have already know this you can see my account opportunities niche so i will go to all tools okay well, what i'll go to all tools then I'll, from there i will go to my ad manager so let's go to our ad manager as you can see this is the ad manager here so for those using mobile you just convert your screen into a desktop screen as usual if you don't know how to do that check my for our facebook instagram ad you see how I converted my phone screen using chrome browser to a laptop screen just like you are seeing from desktop right now okay okay guys um you can see we are in the ad manager now let it fully load up so we are in my business ad manager so you from here i select the ad account i want to use let me just use should i use this uh yeah let me use this this one of my other account so if you want if you have other other account make sure you select it from this down arrow okay then you select the one that you want so next we go to create you can see this create button right the green button here look at it so we go to create and uh, let's say we want to set up a messages ad for this interior decorator so so guys this is tutorial on how to you click next you can see we are at the campaign level you name your campaign here okay you put the name of the campaign let me say interior interior so the next thing you go to next that's all for here and as you can see you have named the campaign you click on next so you can see we are at the asset level right so this way we set up the asset you name the asset the asset is very important because this is what will give the different what this is what you'll be seeing when you are monitoring your ad. So let me say interior deco add one. Let me say add one. So uh, let me name it by the target. So let's say interior deco add luxury. I'm going to target luxury people. So so once you name it, you go down which is click to message if you are running this ad to your whatsapp or instagram 
then it's click to message you can see the messaging apps we have messaging apps we had a facebook had they have messenger whatsapp and instagram direct so you can see you select the, the which is the facebook page this, this is my facebook page which i use in running in commerce which is seller man you can see it right if you have other pages that you want to use you can click this arrow and you select it so then here now you guys can you see you say connect account which is instagram so this my account i don't run i don't have instagram for it but my other account my other ad account like the opportunities niche and others i have instagram connected okay so guys you know how to connect instagram right to your account whatsapp to your account and so many other things you do it you just click here if you have not added it you added your instagram account so we are done from here i select my budget and the budget i'm going to select for this first testing ad is 3k okay i always use 3k for testing so before i optimize the one that is performing well i will add the money and the one that is not performing well i just kill it okay so let's use 3k to test so we select uh, you leave all these things then now you select uh, your age so let's say i want to this is zero target uh let me say this ad is a kind of i'm targeting zero I'm doing zero targeting. Zero targeting is where you are targeting everybody, okay? No specific target. You are targeting everybody. Let me say everybody. But for interior decorator, this one, you are only using it to test. Actually, everybody will not work for interior decoration because it's not everybody that build house. It's people that have houses, that build houses, that they need interior decoration, okay? And uh, also, the people that, uh, can, that rent houses, big houses that uh, can afford such okay not the everybody on facebook or on instagram so but let's just do the zero targeting i see we are targeting nobody so let's leave all these things the same so that in our next duplicate we not target the right set of people so so i will say okay let's leave it in nigeria then i will change the location nigeria but only people living in nigeria so your first thing you should do when targeting the right set of audience is that living in or recently in Nigeria, even people that came to Nigeria, if you leave this automatic option, people that came and left, Facebook will still be showing them your ad and your money will be wasting because they are not in Nigeria and your services is not outside Nigeria. So you have to select it and change it to people living in this location, which is people living only in Nigeria right now. So that is the people that we see. They are not people that came from Dubai, they left because they were recently in the location and they now left. People that came from Ghana and left, okay? So once you are done with that, we come to the age and we click on edit and age. Then let me change it because people that do interior decoration, they should be matured people, not young, young people. I think uh, I will have to start from maybe age 25 minimum, 25 minimum or 30 uh i would have selected 30 but let's just go with 25. all right so once we have set the age like this so you can see we we set the age to 20, 25 to 65 okay so now on this details targeting this where we're supposed to select the right set of people that we think based from our experience that are interested in interior decoration okay that we patronize our services but like i said this is our first campaign in your first campaign what you should always do is that you do zero targeting this is zero targeting now because we are not going into this uh we are not going into the detail targeting which is this so now after we have run this ad we have set up this we now go and duplicate this ad from the asset so we leave this without the uh, targeting that is called zero targeting we are targeting everybody okay so now you select your placement from here like I always say, to get the best audience, your placement, you can remove this messenger, uncheck this messenger, yeah, uncheck it, and also uncheck this audience network. So if you want the ad to run only on Facebook, you can then use this Facebook only. If you want it to work, you uncheck Instagram. If you want the ad to run on both Facebook and Instagram, you check both facebook and instagram so and if you want it to run only you want to run only instagram ad what you do is you uncheck facebook all right guys you hope you get that so that is how simple it is to set up proper ad from business manager 
with a click you can run the ad on facebook and on instagram or only on instagram so having done with that uh, even on the instagram facebook you can select some uh, places so this is it so guys this is the first target we are doing for interior decoration which is zero targeting okay we did zero targeting because we did not target any specific person and it is called zero targeting and we are running the ad on both we are targeting age 25 to 26 and our budget for testing is 3000 naira which we will optimize and increase it when the ad we found out the one also okay well so that is it so the next thing you click on this next to go to the ad level so you can see now we are at the ad level now so here as you know you can put any name at the ad level it's not going to show like i said then here you add setup you leave it then now from here you select your image like i say we select your image for your interior decoration here i'm not an interior decorator uh like i just said this is an example we are going to use and uh, here you select your media your photo or your video like you know all these things right so now your call to action button so now we have set up the first ad you can see it's showing me red review here which is there is a problem you say your ad message destination include instagram direct but there is no instagram account so you see because we this account there's no instagram so that's why you give me this red notice so see guys let's focus on why we are here we are here to know uh, to find out the best uh, target we can make for our ad so now basically this is how you do it when you put your instagram or you remove the instagram since they are giving you uh, the ad has been published so once the ad has been published you come here you hit this cancel uh, button here up here up here left are you seeing it so you hit it so now you can see the ad this is the campaign level you can see this is the interior deco ad it is off because i put it off so i will put it off because i did nothing there okay so now uh the next thing is that you can see this is the campaign level if i click at the campaign level look at which is a deco campaign are you seeing it is deco campaign the one we just created so if i want to go to the asset level now to duplicate it so that i will create another audience because that is a zero audience so now let me click a specific audience let's target people that we know that are specific to like our product so you can see this ad interior deco i say luxury before but actually it was not luxury i can edit it to put it uh not luxury this was zero target this was zero audience let me say zero audience so we targeted zero audience here so that is it <clears throat> So now you can see interior deco at zero audience. So now at this asset level, remember from campaign level, you can see you must highlight it, you must check it. This is the interior deco. You check it from here, this box. Then you now move to the asset level and click on it. Once you click on it, you can see it has one ad set. Are you seeing it? Look at it, one ad set. So this campaign now it has one ad set we are at the asset level we are here look at my uh, mouse makuso we are here so it has one asset so we check it then we now go to duplicate okay so and this is where we duplicate look at this it must show only this logo or it should duplicate so you duplicate it at we are at the asset level and you are duplicating at the asset so read all this you don't need all you need to do so i don't want you you can duplicate like four times then each of those duplicate you now change the audience for one campaign hope you understand this for one campaign you change one you change the other so i don't want you to duplicate like four yes you want to duplicate it into four so that you target four different order but do one at a time okay so that you finish it you do the next one you can see the number of copies you want to duplicate is one just go with one first okay so you click on you hit on the duplicate So once you duplicate, you can see the ad still remain. This is interior deco ad luxury copy. You know, we we that changes we made as luxury does not actually go. So now let's make this one to be the actual luxury. You know, that was zero targeting. So let's make this one to be the actual luxury. Okay, let me say luxury audience. Okay, luxury audience so let me abbreviate it so this one now we are going to target luxury people the same ad okay same ad so the budget still remain 3000 so when you are 
testing for an asset, the one that is working better, you make sure that the amount is the same, which is 3K as we use. So now when you come to here, you can see for the general, uh, for the zero target we just did, which we mean we are not targeting, the age was 25. Let's still read the age and we are still targeting people living in Nigeria, okay? So now when it now comes to detail targeting, okay? So that is where we are going to make some changes, okay? So now look at this detail targeting. So after the age, then you have the gender, which is all gender. Then we have detail targeting. We, you hit on this edit. And once you hit on the edit, now you can now select the kind of people you want to target for specific ads. So this ad, we are targeting luxury. So because interior decorator, people that are interested in luxury, they are, we perceive, we understand. If it's the interior decoration, it's your business, you should know that yeah, these kind of people are very interested in interior decoration, which is luxury people that are interested in luxury. Okay, you can see, okay, Facebook is bringing them luxury goods. Let's click on luxury first. So you can see luxury have been selected here. So let's add another luxury. Oh, this ad will just be luxury, luxury stuff, okay? So that is how to do proper targeting with your Facebook and Instagram advert, okay? So now we select luxury goods people that are interested in luxury lifestyle look at them let's select luxury lifestyle so you can see luxury luxury lifestyle and uh, you can be checking the number of uh, estimated audience here we have about 18 thousand 18 i think 18 million 18 million to 21 million already so you can select luxury let's see if there are luxury houses people that are interested in luxury houses so let's say luxury let me put luxury home and see. Is there anything like that? No. Yeah. No, no luxury home. Okay. Let me, okay, let's say people that are interested in luxury resorts. So yeah, almost the same thing with home, okay? So we target them. So in this, you can keep doing this. You can target all the luxury. In fact, Make sure that this access, this particular access, is you only target all the luxury, so that you know if luxury is working. If you exhaust, you can even go to suggest on that Facebook. Facebook will give you luxury goods. You understand? So, but you make sure that the real estate investing. So, but if you if you want to target them, Facebook is not telling you. But I don't want to put any real estate. I just want to target love people that are interested in luxury lifestyle, luxury resort, luxury hotels, luxury. Uh, cars and all those things so you target them because those are people that have money if you are running ad for an e-commerce product or you are running ad for interior decoration uh, services as we say in this ad so now this is another ad set now so once you are done everything is said you hit on this publish again so you can see say some item we are not published because i didn't set up anything i didn't put video i didn't put anything so that's why so i don't care so it's okay for me if you are doing the proper make sure you put all the headlines the everything as you know so now once you are done again once again you hit this back arrow you hit it back i'm doing it in a way that you will understand so guys how do you see this we are in our asset level this campaign level this is the asset level now so how do you see it now so you can see where the asset level what well, is the campaign this is the asset level this is one campaign remember this one campaign which is look at the one that is checked here this is deco campaign so when you highlight it you check it from here and you now go to the asset level you can see we are now having two assets this one is interior deco at luxury audience this is the one i just created that is for luxury this is the first one which this one is not supposed to be luxury it's supposed to be so that this is how you identify the different asset level it's supposed to be zero audience interior deco at zero audience right let me change the name so So you can see interior deco zero order this is the first one this is the second one now remember the amount the budget is 33k so because we are trying to see which of this asset uh, duplicate is going to work so we are testing different audience so now you can still check it again can you see this level so you can see it now you still check one of the ad set then you now hit on duplicate again 
So now once you duplicate, I say always go with one. You can duplicate into four, but don't confuse yourself. Just go with one and finish it. Then you do the next one just like that and you click on next. So guys, you can see now we are still on the asset level we just duplicated. Remember for this campaign, everything remains the same. The image, the photo, the text, the primary text, everything is the same. The only difference is the audience. We are trying to see which of the other was over. So this one now, let's change the ad name because the ad name that you are going to be seeing. Let's change the ad name from zero audience to now. Um, let's target, uh, let's say interior decorator interior decoration services people that are interested in real estate they are also interested in interior decoration but if you find that real estate people they are your competitor don't target them but if you know they are not your competitor like uh, interior decoration people that are very interested in interior decoration there are people that have money like people that do a lot of travel air travel let me just target travel people people that are interested in travel so they have money so these are people that have money. so there's the interior decorator travel audience travel audience okay so now everything is said the same thing the budget is 3k same thing the what is it called the with nigeria people that are strictly living in nigeria and the, the age is 25 to 65 though this 65 is kind of too much for me actually let me reduce this time around you should take the age people that build let me take the age to 55 okay to 55 so that our money will not be wasted our money will be utilized very well so now once we do the age we come to detail targeting again and we will come here which is uh, edit so now in this year remember now we are going to do detail targeting let's try uh, target people that travel a lot because people that travel a lot is people that have eat and they have belly food sorry to use that language that travel a lot like frequent travelers so you target them so let's travel air travel travel by air let's travel by air people that travel by air they are interested in luxury in interior decoration okay Inter okay look at the frequent international let me scroll up frequent international traveler so i will go with this one these people have money so this is how you target you cannot target travelers all the travelers here you can so travelers insurance all those things they are here so when you seek will you select one if you exist the option you see this return from travel one week ago you can see all these people travel plus leisure people that travel for leisure you target them you understand so these are people that have the money okay to patronize your uh what is it called to patronize your interior decoration services so i'm just using this as an example once you are done if you the, it's not it's not much you can use facebook uh suggestion after selecting two or three you can see tourism yes this is a good option they are also part of travel so once you are done again this is the third asset now you are targeting rich people that are inter interested in vacations is part of travel you target uh, frequent international traveler frequent traveler tourism vacation so once you are done with the selection of this particular asset then you now click on publish once again and once it has been published successfully you don't have an issue like this one i'm having issue because i didn't set it up uh, properly then once you are done no issue you now click on this cancel button and now you can see Look at the we are at the asset level. This is why this area is wide. So if I click here now, which is the campaign level, you can see we are seeing in deco campaign. This is one campaign. And when we tick it, we check it from here and go to the asset level. You can see we have three assets. This was the first one, which is zero audience. Three budget is three thousand naira. Interior deco luxury audience. We are targeting luxury audience in this asset now, huh? and we have. 
budget is the same three thousand so guys this is how you do it so in your next one you might target real estate depending on your product and you now have four assets in this area with the same amount of budget with the same amount of primary with the same primary test with the same ad copy let me just say video or text so now in this audience some will perform better you can make it four or five okay five is okay at least don't try more than five audience maximum at a time okay so five is okay four to five is okay so therefore guys you now try and see with this same amount same primary text same uh, ad copy i mean primary text your image or photo you'll not be able to know which one is performing well so how do you know that the one that is performing well an average and uh, so we are now moving at the uh, third part of this tutorial which is after this ad have been published now they are running at the same budget you cannot install a facebook ad manager on your phone okay so that when you come immediately to your phone you log in and uh, you cannot see uh, how it works the one that is giving you result and how do you know the one that is giving you better result or the one that is performing better is that the first thing you check is after 24 hours okay 24 hours is the minimum you can leave it to work for 48 hours okay 48 hours is recommended because some ad with this ad some of the, this campaign on this asset the conver uh, the conversion per, per, per result okay the message conversation uh, conversion you, know, you can see the result here so from your mobile this thing is also very self-explanatory so you cannot see per message conversion which is here okay so per messages conversion which is the r result so it will be showing you how much it is actually spending okay so per message conversion so and that amount if you are using an error it's sometimes some of this ad will start at high level some will be running 500 or 300 error per message conversion leave it leave it after 24 hours and you see that the price the cost per uh, per charges per conversation will be going down so now after leaving it for 24 to 48 hours you will now see the one that is working at a lower cost okay so maybe a, the one that is working at 69 error 16 error 100 error 150 okay 150 error if you are using the nera account okay if it's in dollar at least 0 0.4 maximum okay okay yeah 0 0.4 dollar maximum for me when an ad is running more than 0 0.4 i kill it so which is uh if i this more running more than 150 uh it's running more than 200 naira per conversation i kill it okay so but if your product is high ticket 200 naira is still good but a good price should start like from 17 naira 100 naira 150 naira it's going to be profitable if the product you are selling is not that high ticket but if it's a high ticket 200 naira 250 300 naira is still manageable if it's a high ticket Product, okay so guys what i'm trying to say is that a good ad should be delivery at 100 naira or less than or 150 maximum okay so now at the end of the day the one among this interior luxury you will now see the result the reach the the the, the number of people per conversation here it will be here you are safe to manage the download your uh, manager account to, uh, on your phone download your facebook ad manager on your phone so that you'll be seeing it so clean so guys at the end of the day the one that this one may break like 20 30 people and the cost per each person may be 100 naira. this one may bring like 40 people and the cost per each ad is like 120 and this zero target in may bring about for example it might bring like just 12 people compare this one brought 30 this one brought 40 this one brought 12 and the cost per this 12 per this individual that costs you is about 200 naira so which means it's far higher than this ones and the amount of people that it brought is far lesser so this ad is not working well after 20, 48 hours okay or 24 after 48 hours okay so you kill this particular one any of this one that is not working well then these ones that are working very well since the budget is uh, 30 three thousand naira, you increase the budget at least by 30 percent which means i don't know how you calculate the percentage you increase it like to about four thousand naira. don't increase it 
uh, once after 48 hours you increase the budget like 4k okay and then like 5k for example okay so you keep keep increasing it small small don't increase it to 50 percent don't increase it to 100 percent don't say six stars at once no put it at 4k the next day put it at 5k the next day put it at 6k okay then you create the you cannot create look alike for this one the one that is performing well you don't have to be creating new new asset again the one that is performing well you can create the look alike audience so that it will be bringing more people like those ones okay after creating the custom audience for it okay so guys this is how it works and that is how you know which are these performing well and that is how you do the duplicate and that is how you target specific kind of people that will buy product from you so if you get benefit from this guy i'm zack at opportunities in it once again please i want my channel to grow help me if you got value from this video subscribe to my channel turn on the bell notification like this video please don't go without liking this video because i'm going to be dropping more tutorials maybe in my next tutorial i'll bring uh, how to download and install your facebook ad manager to monitor your ad result okay thank you very much and god bless you